As more of America's meatpacking plants suspend production due to COVID-19 outbreaks, there is now less product on most store shelves, but some smaller shops suddenly finding themselves in a better position to weather the storm. NBC 15's Darwin Singleton shows us how. Where's the beef? Well, in several states, you won't find it at Wendy's hamburger chain right now. With meat processing plants shutting down due to cases of COVID-19, some meats are in limited supply at several restaurant chains and on shelves of some grocery stores. Meanwhile, here in Alabama, David and Shay Baralt stopped by Mosley's Meat Market in Mobile to stock up for a weekend barbecue. Petite fillets, bacon wrapped petite fillets. And now that I mentioned it. I guess I did notice at some of the grocery stores, the meat selection is not what it, not what it was. But here at Mosley's, the cases are full, the selection unaffected so far. We're grateful for the business. We're so happy, but I just wish it was for better circumstances. Jacob Mosley and family have been here for more than 40 years. He says they won't be affected by the closing of those huge meat packing plants out west because that's not their source. We get most of our stuff from a company called Greater Omaha in Nebraska we're really happy with. It's a much smaller facility. That way it's a lot easier to just kind of keep an eye on everything. Because of that, prices here remain steady as families rush to grocery stores to load up on everyday meats like ground beef and chicken breast. But as choice cuts disappear there, new customers are coming here. Exactly. We're seeing a bunch of new faces and we're doing our best to let them know how good a job we do and how much we appreciate them. There's a bit of irony in this story. Wendy's used to have Mosley supply its local restaurants with patties and they use this device to do it. But that was nearly 50 years ago. In Mobile, Darwin Singleton, NBC 15 News.